Right, okay, so we're recording. George, good morning. Good morning. Uh, it's uh, Monday, the 10th of October, and uh, we're just looking at your blog. Um, uh, first of all, I'm going to ask you how generally you're finding media studies. Are you, are you happy loving with it. everything? Yeah, you I'm like it? it? Right, you love it. Right, okay, that's good to know. You certainly seem to, which is a great, a, a great thing. Um, okay, so if we just look at your blog um, in order, so we've got your, your favourite film now, then we've got the brief, um, and you've got the assessment criteria, so that's the, the kind of basics on there. You did an, you did an analysis of um, Skyfall, which was very good. Um, don't forget to do the um, highlighting. Slide, to do highlighting and terminology. It is, it is okay. important. So, so, but I think that you've got a really good understanding of technical aspects, shot types, camera movements, those sorts of things, which is brilliant. Okay, that's really good Thank to you. see. Um, if you're doing, because obviously you'll need to do a few more film analyses, and um, make sure you include the titles as well, because titles yeah. is a big part of what you know your. The work. title scenes after, isn't it? Yeah. And the, about the opening, after yeah, the first bon- opening scene, and it only came up with, um, it ended when he got to the uh, building. Yes, yeah. Bond is always a bit different, isn't it? Because they have very elaborate yeah. um, title sequences. That's like that. Yeah. It's one of their things, well, isn't it? Yeah, that's little, little video sort of thing. Um, so um, that's just a thing to look out for, because titles and fonts, that's all really important. Yeah. So, um, I might so be able to find a screenshot like other on Google, but search separately. Yeah. That might work. Yes. Then we've got um, a really, really good analysis of Inception. Thank you. The Inception I, I, I need to highlight everything. Yeah, so you need to highlight things, but this time we've got the eye dense. Yeah. Um, and you've got uh, so check spelling. Of, um, yeah. It's a good idea if you are going to do something which is a lot of text, is just type it into Word to begin with. And then just copy and paste oh, yeah, it, like and, you know, it. You, and get get it spell checked because that's one thing which a lot a lot of people do is just type straight into Blogger and then there's usually a typo, so that's yeah. a good idea to do that. Um, but you've got talking about camera work. What's another word for a main character? Is it protagonist? Yeah. yeah. So we could start saying protagonist, couldn't we? To get that terminology. Okay. Um, but you talked about narrative enigma, connotation and denotation. Uh, more towards the top, less towards more the towards bottom. The top. Yeah, more towards like, the starting. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Okay. So it's really, really in depth, actually. And you're using stills, which is brilliant. The reason why I ended it there is because it's sort of the, the the opening to Inception is really weird. Like it has an mm. opening and it has a further opening, and I wasn't sure whether to because the timing's really different. Like. It goes from him being like dressed as if he has, if he's homeless, to being yeah. dressed in a suit. Yeah. And I thought that may be like a like a different time frame. So I thought I'd end it where I thought would be the opening ending. Sure. Yeah. Because it was, it was it was a bit weird. That's fine. And it's what four? It was originally like four minutes long, but. So you've looked at the first couple of couple of minutes. Yeah. Which is fine because because the, the opening that you make is only going to be a few minutes yeah. long. So that's that's totally fine. Okay. So from here. What do we need next then? So we're going to need to... How's your prelim coming along? Uh, finished. Finished, right, All okay. uploaded. All uploaded onto... Oh, not onto my uh, blog, on, onto YouTube. It's onto YouTube, blog. right. So it's on YouTube, so we need to get that on there. And then there needs to be a write-up, like a very honest kind of yeah. review of what you know, what's good about it, what's not so good about it. What yeah. would you, if you were going to do it again, what would you do differently? I'm all, um, I've also... Um, pretty much finished the analysis of the past years That's great pretty much done excellent so. okay so that needs to go on there as well um, so you, so I'm, I'm pretty happy with how you're doing so far I think I think you you, you know as that all that stuff needs to be on by the time we break up yeah. so you're comfortable that yeah, can be yeah, done I, I I'll be have a go that. as well when you're doing your analyses um, of doing one that isn't doing a couple that aren't typed you know so do a, so download the clip yeah. when you, you've got a means of downloading yeah. a, a film opening drop it into Final Cut and then there is actually a voiceover thing on Final Cut you can just record that straight into it so you could just watch the film opening make some notes drop it into Final Cut 
and then just record a voiceover over the top of it, yeah. almost like a director's commentary sort yeah. of thing if you've ever seen them, which is quicker. Yeah, I don't have to worry about getting it all wrong. And actually, like, because... No, I mean, it still needs to be, you know, accurate, and yeah. it still needs to, to have the same kind of stuff, but it's just quicker, isn't it? And, it's and, and also, it'd be more enjoyable to do, because, mm. like, it's sort of like, if you don't have Final Cut, mm. it's sort of, like, enjoyable, like, editing, stuff like that. Yeah. So it's probably more... Definitely. And when you go into do. production, um, I'll be getting you to do that a lot, you know, to yeah. do, like, vodcasts and podcasts and things like that to record your progress rather than type on yeah. time. like, different multimedias yeah. on a blog. Yeah, the exam board wants to see that. So there's... I can... Or type in, like, video, audio... Audio, yeah, so you can get a SoundCloud account if you haven't already yeah. got one and just do, you know... So you can record on your, on your phone, probably, or on your MacBook... Um, and it's just a quick and easy way of getting evidence onto your blog yeah. and it's something I, you know, I want you to do more of but overall um, I'm really happy with it as long okay. as the prelim's on uh, yeah. sharpish and um, in terms of grading at the moment um, we're in this section here we're doing research and planning mm -hmm. and I would put it's hard to say because it's yeah. it's a mark for the whole thing, but yeah. I think you're kind of on the on the boundary from what I've seen between proficient and excellent, which okay. is a good place to be at yeah. the very start of the course. So um, that would be kind of what what the could, what could I do to improve terminology? Okay, terminology. Get your terminology locked down. Be Spot really on. really specific about camera shots and um, camera movement as well. I feel I haven't talked about camera movement enough to the class. In, you know, would it would it be good if you know that thing? that you show us with all the different types of shots what they're called like all the initials like um, like close up yeah so even like close up stuff like that yeah would it be good to like memorise them and then write about them specifically yeah okay. yeah it would be good actually the next thing you're going to do uh, which is quick, which you'll enjoy is um, we're going to make a thing called a Swede do you know what a Swede is no. so it's where you where it's where you make like an ultra low budget version of a big Hollywood film yeah. like with, for, with hopefully comedic um, results mm. um, so you, we're going to we're going to do that and in that you'll be able to go through the process of shot listing you know doing shot lists um, framing things filming things so you'll learn a lot more about it there at that point but, um, yeah, um, the internet is great. If you're not sure what, if, you, if you're seeing a shot from a film opening and you're thinking, is that a medium shot or is that a you know, long shot or, yeah. a, or a, a, a medium long shot? Well, I've quoted things like wide angles, close-ups, yeah. tracking shots, stuff like that. Yeah. I think I should go more in-depth. So... Rather than in depth, just just like specific, point specific, it's but it's to do with being specific mm -hmm. and also um, being being strong on the connotation and denotation and connotation. So looking at costume, you know, what yeah. are the filmmakers telling us by the way a character is dressed or the way they like you know, if in that scene of Inception, yeah. the uh, guy dressed in um, like a uniform, yeah, kind uh, of having power over mm. the fact that he's looking down. Exactly. Have connotations of him being more powerful exactly. or in charge. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, so that's that's where we're at. And um, yeah. Okay. All right. I'm happy with everything. You know okay. you know what needs to be done. Uh-huh. That's by that's by Thursday the twentieth. So that's a week on Thursday. That's not this coming Thursday but the one yeah. after that. And um, yeah, that's so great. So basically that one that one that's pretty much enough I can get that done this lesson mm. that and then three more yeah okay got it yeah is that alright mm -hmm. that's great okay, okay. alright All right. thanks Josh thank you I'll email this to you now okay